Back, NBC6 Responds continues taking an in-depth look at the issue surrounding medical debt. The impact of it can stay with you for years, but there are steps you can take before it becomes a problem, including negotiating the amount you owe for a medical bill. And one expert says you should do this before your bill gets sent to collections and ends up on your credit report. When Rachel Stamatidis got a bill for more than $3,200 after a trip to the emergency room, she was overwhelmed. It feels like a waste of money. Like, why? The bill for the hour she says she spent at a local ER included a $60 charge for ibuprofen and left her questioning why she had been charged so much. NBC6 Response helped reduce her bill by a few hundred dollars after calling the hospital. Well, most people believe that the bill is what they owe. Attorney Michael Walrath helps patients fight exorbitant medical bills. He says under Florida law, patients only owe the reasonable value of the care they receive. Which is much, much less than their full bill charges in every case I've ever seen in the past 10 years. A hospital would have a very tough time proving in court that the reasonable value of an aspirin is $50 when we all know it isn't. He says if you get a medical bill you feel is too high, dispute it in writing as soon as you get it. You should always try to negotiate with the hospital. You should never assume that you have to pay the full bill. And you should do this before you start a payment plan. Once you start making payments on the bill, you've agreed to the full amount. Uh, legally speaking, so you can no longer challenge the bill as unreasonable. So you could be making a very small payment a month, miss that payment, and suddenly they would they would come after you for the full amount, and they would get a judgment for that full amount because you've agreed to it. If a medical bill ends up in collections and on your credit report, there is some good news. Medical debt does not impact your credit score the way other debts do. April Lewis Parks of Consolidated Credit Counseling Services says it can take up to six months for medical debt to appear on your credit report. And when it does, it counts less toward your credit score than other types of debt. And within six months of on-time payment, your credit score should increase. And if you stay on that path, it should get better again to where it used to be. Rachel, meanwhile, told us back then she was going to figure out a way to pay to avoid any damaging marks on her credit. It's caused us to like have to, you know, save more, budget more, even more so than we already have. Now, it's important to be proactive and check your credit report for inaccuracies at least once a year. You can do that for free at annualcreditreport.com. Some people may not even realize a medical bill has gone to collections until they check their credit report, Juwan. Yeah, very good point, Alina. And you can make a donation to the not-for-profit called RAP Medical Debt to help rescue someone from it. Our company did, and it is expected to wipe out more than a million dollars of medical debt in South Florida. So join us on this and just attend dollar donation can wipe away one thousand dollars in medical debt so we show you how this all works and how to donate at nbc6.com slash